So one of the side things I've been doing is working on people's systems, and this is the system right here, it's Behemoth. The guy handed it to me, and he basically wanted me to uh, reformat his drive. So he was having drive issues, it was slow performance, and so what I did is I used something called Disk Genius, and Disk Genius is what you use to be able to format a drive from a bootable disk. And the reason why you do that is because you can't boot um, the C drive like that um, and go ahead and format it because you're actively using it. So you have to boot to a bootable disk to be able to um, format both drives. So I formatted them because he wants it to be wiped clean. And I'm actually creating Windows 11 Media on a boot drive so that moving forward, I can put it in here, get Windows on it and go from there. And so, that's kind of what I'm working on now. I did just get the screen too for a replacement where I have to meet somebody to replace their screen. So I have another screen I have to replace in two weeks in another part of the state. And it's not that far away, but when you say another part of the state, it sounds like it's really far, um, but it's, it's not. Um, so I'll be replacing that screen. And I actually learned how to replace screens from Lenovo. I used to work at Lenovo and I used to fix about 10 to 15 computers a day. It came to motherboards, screens, uh, keyboards. Those tend to be the most common. Um, and so that's how I typically know how to do screens. And if you want to know about that, you totally can. And I can show it to you all. But that's kind of what I'm working on now. Now, on top of that, if you're looking at eBay, um, you want to find a niche that kind of works for you. So for me, I've been doing like vintage electronics and I've been doing... Uh, kind of working on utilitarian electronics typically like networking or anything like that that I can find and that people like because it's able to be used in kind of important ways you know so uh, let's restart this I have to reboot this system because I need to take this out to make sure that it doesn't boot back to that and it boots to my Windows 11 but Right now, I've actually sold three things today. I sold a monitor. I sold um, two phones. They're like businessy phones I found online. Um, a lot of people sell them on Craigslist or stuff like that because a lot of businesses want to stop using them. But people online always buy them because there are a lot of small time businesses or uh, companies that like to get those types of things. So I'm able to reach those types of people by doing that. And right now you're just watching me work on this but um and so that's how I typically get people to buy that stuff um, I actually ordered the screen off, screen off of Amazon uh, to be able to replace uh, it was one of those one-offs where I actually ordered the screen for someone they were a little older weren't really sure how to use Amazon and everything so but most of the time I'll have I'll send them the link to order it and then I meet them and replace their screen it doesn't take me too long um, and so we're gonna boot up into Windows 11 and get this resolved because this system was having some problems. Look at that. We're gonna boot into that, install, and now we're in setup. So this is how you reformat a drive. You take Disk Genius, you put it on a bootable disk, uh, you plug it in, it boots from the disk. You make you make it so that USB is the thing that can it can boot from, and then. Um, you right click, you press format, you keep it on NTFS because that's ideal for Windows and you format them both. I format the C and D drive for him so I'm able to clear that and I'm trying to master the art of multitasking so I actually just boxed up both things in my truck and now I'm going to go to the mail when I get a chance and drop it off at the self-service kiosk. Um, if you can find a self-service kiosk, it's definitely your friend because um, a lot of times uh, especially for someone who's at work um, <laughs> you have a hard time kind of getting there when it's open so if you can do a self-service kiosk and just get the labels yourself and go from there it's typically a lot better all right so we're gonna hit next and let's see let's do this right here and we are going to clear everything Yep, just make it all unallocated and go from there. 
once we do this then we will add everything on so let's do that let's do that we'll delete this right here and basically right now i'm just deleting the partitions and getting it fresh so we're gonna refresh that now we're gonna go to drive so we want to put it on drive zero so next we add it and there we go we're gonna copy it on there so that'll take a little bit um, I'm gonna leave the system and just make sure that it gets windows the way it's supposed to and kind of go from there um, but now that that's completed uh, we'll go back to what I was talking about so yeah to use a self-service kiosk um, do eBay uh, if you're like if you're doing eBay then you would use that and then you would kind of drop things off at your leisure which is what has worked for me so far I just dropped the monitor off at UPS I don't typically do UPS but with Mercari the person chose like it was UPS um, but typically I do USPS is perfectly fine I just make sure that I put a lot of paper, I put a lot of wrapping, I put a lot of safe stuff, I put fragile on the side just to make sure that it doesn't uh, get thrown around because a lot of it's tech and I don't want it to break. Um, and so that's kind of how I've been managing. Now, as you can see, I'm in my office at work because I started this after work and I need to finish downloading some files and doing some stuff. But once I'm done, I should be done for the day. So I'll let this run. We're multitasking. I'm still in work clothes and hopefully it keeps going one of the last things i like to do to kind of wrap up uh, getting someone their computer back is i like to clean it i like to give them a clean computer when they get it back so um after this i'm going to be cleaning i actually have like a little keyboard tool for dusting that i use so i'm going to use like a screen uh, protector something uh, safe here like air duster to get everything out from the cracks because there's a few things like right there in here and then from there uh, it will be done so we'll get this finished and until then I'll see you tomorrow